coming at you with another quick PSA here. I don't know if you'll be able to see this or not, but they're the extruder gear motor right here, the stepper. You can see that I have no filament coming out of the hot end right now. And um, I thought it was maybe a nozzle clog or something like that, but you can see right here the extruder stepper motor is turning. Right, it is rotating, but our extruder gear has either stripped out from the shaft or uh, these small, this is hard to do through the camera, but these small set screws have come loose from the stepper drive shaft, right? So I was, I was looking around the whole time thinking, why is this not extruding properly? Uh, was my temperature off, something like that? And all it is, is that these little set screws, I think, have hopefully come loose. And it's not a function of them being stripped out. So it's a quick PSA. Um, normally, the ANET A8 has a fan here over the extruder itself. Um, I don't have that and the reason I don't have that is for um, actually for reasons like this. I like to see it open so um, hopefully this helps somebody out if you can't figure out why you're not getting any extrusion always check that uh, the drive gear and the set screws. Okay so what I'm going to do to attempt to fix this is I will go up to control, that's a lie, prepare, move axis, I'll go to extruder, move one millimeter, and you should, now I'll go up or down, now you should be able to see that shaft, see how that shaft's moving and the bushing, or the gear itself? Well, what we can do is hold one, right? For instance, hold this. <laughs> see if I can do this. Hold this. Hold the gear itself, and then what? A just pain in the butt these buttons are, aren't they? Okay. Then, right? See, I can hold this gear while the shaft moves okay and then I'm going to wait I'm going to move the shaft to where the flat point can go to um, my set screw so that's all I've been doing just moving up and down one millimeter until that set screw aligns I'm going to tighten this set screw, I'm going to do it again, and then uh, move it to where this set screw's vertical, tighten that one, and then she should be good to go. Alright, so there we go. You can see that motor working real good. Real good, real good. Um, not exactly happy with the uh, layer height I got on there with the auto level, but I think... Uh, in troubleshooting there, I kind of set my Z offset a little bit too high, but it'll work. It's holding down. I have a lot of uh, a lot of uh, additional layers on there for brim, so should hold to the bed fast. But you can see that uh, extruder gear is moving along. So hopefully you enjoyed this. Uh, check out the link in the description. I started a Discord server. I'm going to have some more videos up here in a short while. Just thought this was a quick, nice and easy one in case somebody's stuck and can't figure out why they can't get their prints. So, uh, yeah, keep your amps up and your filament dry. <laughs>